a brisk winter's day here in the beer meadow as my Sean Connery Kenny Rogers tribute beard is fluffed with humidity and in an effort to diversify our drink list up this round on a beer snobs cheap brew review is White Claw Hard Seltzer. And if you made it this far into the video and you like hard seltzer, uh, go ahead and slap that subscribe button down below if you would, please. That'd be awesome. I've been fighting this hard seltzer thing for quite a while. And so I said, you know, why don't we give it a go and see what all the hype is about? 5% alcohol. They market it as an alcohol drink for people who are health conscious. And it got its start in Dublin, Ireland. Thanks, Google. All right, let's pop the tap and see what we got the hard seltzer edition and just a whiff of an opening and once again to those two viewers who are killing me for drinking uh, the cheap brews out of the can or a bottle your comments have caused inspiration and it has driven us to make merch our exclusive a beer snobs cheap brew review pint glass where we pop the top and see what we got here this pours for you exactly how I imagined it being. Looks pretty much like uh, if you're a child of the 90s, what a Zima look like. I went for the big can of White Claw, 24 ounces, I think it is. It sure feels like it. Got it for like $1.35. Let's do what the glass says and let's pop the top and see what we got. Here's looking up your seltzer. Man, right off the top, look at that. sort of has a Alka-Seltzer type of an odor to it. I was expecting this White Claw to be a lot more sweet. Mango flavor. Where they're hiding the mango, I've got no idea. I can't even taste it. If I'm detecting any mango at all in this, it would be me drinking a glass of seltzer water and somebody sliced a mango about 35 feet away from me. <laughs> You know, and I thought that this whole seltzer craze was for the ladies until I saw a lot of my fellows starting to drink this stuff. <coughs> I saw a couple of frat guys carrying a few cases of this White Claw across the street, and so I paused for a moment, took a swig of Jim Beam out of my flask and said, are you kidding me? I guess if you don't like drinking, uh, you would like White Claw hard seltzer. <sighs> I mean, there is no flavor to it at all. Even though it says mango, it is a seltzer water. And if you take out the seltzer part, it's just water. I don't know what to review because I don't taste anything. It's like a cup of water. It's crisp, it's refreshing, it's poundable on a beach if you're uh, tailgating, I guess. <clears throat> if you fully enjoy anything with flavor, you would not like this. It's the vape version of a beer. Well, nothing really to report here. Uh, it's fizzy water. Uh, would I ever drink it again? No. I suppose maybe if uh, you're running a 5K and they had uh, a table of these set up at every mile point, yeah, you probably drink it. So out of five stars, five being a very good cheap brew or just a very good brew or just a brew in general, which I don't even know if it's even brewed. What would I give White Claw Hard Seltzer? I'm gonna give it a two point. 08 out of five stars. They go, hey, if you haven't clicked subscribe already, please do so. Join our Facebook group, a Beer Snobs Cheap Brew Review. And hey, it's a nice day here in the beer meadow. Don't just sit there, grab yourself a cheap brew or a hard seltzer. Cheers.